today, you will understand how to view a pending change request from a bill of material and routing function. Changes to products can have significant impact on the bill of material and routing functions. For this reason, an engineer wants to be informed if there is a change request in the process for the product he wants to design or produce. This demonstration shows how a change request will impact the bill of material and the routing. Changes to products can have a significant impact on a bill of material and routing. For this reason, an engineer, a design engineer, a planner wants to be informed if there is a change request in process for the product he wants to design or produce. We'll go to the change request function to create a new request for a product supporting bill of material and routing. We'll now create a new change request by clicking the Create button in the right panel. The product is FIN020. After entering the product, you can select a reason for the change, the severity of the change, the change impact, and you'll notice that the change manager is automatically defaulted. After completing the fields, click Save to complete your change request. We'll now set the change request to In Review to start the process. Up to this point, the change request was not considered in progress. Now we will look at the bill of material for the product FIN020. Notice that we can find the change request number in the header. You will also find the change request number related to a component in the grid if a change is in process for one of the components. Now we will examine the routing for the product FIN020. Here we find our change request number in the heading of the routing. In this topic, you have learned how to view inquiries and to display change requests from the bill of material and routing functions.